today i'm going to demonstrate acf repeater using the plus add-ons first of all you will need acf repeater which is available in their pro version which you can find from this link now let's see which plugins we already have installed in our setup you will need ECF custom fields pro ECF custom fields Elementor and Elementor Pro Elementor Pro is not necessary for this demo now first of all let's set up ECF field as you can see there is an option for a custom fields in that you need to press add new where you just need to put the title Let's put test title. Let's make add new field group where you need to put a title. After that, you can add one field. Here, you can add the field label. Then, you will have a field name. This ID you will need to use in Elementor widget. After that, you have option for field type in a field type you have different options from that you need to find out repeater which is available in layout field once you have a repeater in a field type you will have option for a subfields where you can add multiple fields here you go with the label then you can select field type for that then you can write instructions and other things so all these options and the tutorial of all the ACF you can find out on a Google or we will put a link of that in a description below now we already have a pre-built repeater demo which you can see over here let's go to the ACF repeater well, we already have created a field. Its name is repeater. You can see there are three different subfields: city name, image, and the link. All three have different field type. For here, we have used text field type. In image, we have selected image as a field type. And for the link, we have selected URL as a field type. So this way we already have set up a repeater in ACF. You can see all the options available here. Let's update it. Now to set up ACF repeater like this, this is a post where we have set up ACF repeater. So let's go to any post here let's add one new you can put any text over here or you can make that page using edit with Elementor now here you will find ACF repeater options where you need to enter city name image and the link so let's add a row here i'm adding the city name then i'm adding one image and i am putting a link for example let's put google.com i can add multiple links over here Let's select another image. Let's put a link as a has. So you can add multiple. Right. Now let's publish this post. They are asking 
to add a valid URL because we have selected field type as a URL. So let's copy the same URL. Okay, now we have published this post. So this is just a dummy data. Now we need to make a template for that ACF repeater. So let's go to the templates. From there, you have saved templates. Well, we already have one ACF repeater template built in, but let's add new. Here you need to use TP custom field widget just to make a layout of your ACF repeater field. Now here you will have option for a field key. So let's go and find out our field key. This is the ACF repeater and there is a field key which is repeater so let's put it over here now here you need to select a field type for example let's choose an image right if you are selecting an image as a field type then we need to put image field type over here let's put it in a field key section Right. There are other options like open in new tab or the alignment and other options. So let's publish it. Now to view a review of that template you made, you need to go to templates again. When you go to the templates, let's go to the ACF repeater field too. Well, you will have options for the render mode. In a render mode, you can select ACF repeater content. Once you select the ACF repeater content, you will have an option to preview post. Like whichever the post names you have, you can find it out and you can put that so they can use that as a demo. So let's put a new post as a demo and then you will have option for ACF field. So if that have an ACF field, it will show over here. So here is your ACF field. Just you need to update this. Once you update this with the, all the options. And now let's go to the Elementor edit and refresh it. You will find out all the demo content and the loop over here right you have the link now let's put a title so let's go again tp custom field you just need to put it over here now here you need to put a field key so in our case let's put a city name underneath so it's a type is text so here you need to select a link or the HTML as per your needs. Let's put a link over here and here is a field name. So whatever the city name it will be available over here. Then you have option for a link type if you need a default link email or the telephone. So let's keep a default link then if you want then you can enable ACF field key in which you can select a custom field so that you can use these links over there. So let's put pardon, let's select the field value, it's a link, and put that over here. So if you go over that, you will find out there is a link which you will add. 
from your post so this is your demo like here you can select and make it center alignment right there are other options as well to open link on a new tab or the download on the link these alignment options are responsive as well then you will have option for the different field types as well so you can use that as per your needs even in the style tab you will have typography options the color options fading background border options so all those options you can manage from this all this settings panel let's keep that as it is and let's make the image the round radius and let's update it now here we have made a repeater acf fields layout now if you want to use that we need a listing which you can make from a blog single page which for that you will need element of two Don't forget to subscribe us. See you in the next video.